Sorry, broski. Hey, don't make me commit one eight seven, home. Nasty crush, bro. That was a nasty crush. <sighs> oh, man. Let's not fucking drive, guys. Let's not fucking drive. <laughs> Yo, nah, nah, not doing that to a woman. Not doing that to a woman, man. What does this say?
Uh, the amount of times oh, I fell hey. off this bike, bro. Give me my bike back. out with that thing which we did and our past indiscretions would who told you that did i tell you that i'm in charge here fruity me you understand uh, not quite well can you explain that again what i was saying <laughs> oh you're good the three cunts listen we need help with something else some of the government some of it is pretty corrupt not, uh, not your bit, right? Yes, but we're corrupt in a good way. But the agency, they want to encourage panic so they can guarantee their budgets. That's how they get paid. It's a major problem. And now they've secured some funds that we need to use in our fight against crime as a way of bribing corrupt officials. Really? And where are they getting that from? Drugs. Those bastards love to sell drugs. Who doesn't? <laughs> We think they're going to use this money to finance a war on our streets. And we need you boys to requisition that money for us. The bonds are leaving the terminal in an armored car. Yeah, fuck you, Dave. We don't have time to prepare the right way. <laughs> it's not my concern. I cannot allocate any more resources to this. You'll be fine. Fuck you, Dave. Nice work, Slick. We're going to be doing pat-downs at the airport before those fucking clowns are done with us. You know, fuck you. Hey, hey, look, man. It is what it is. Now, how the fuck we gonna get this done? I don't know. I got it. Classic blitz play. It's an industrial area, right? So I'm thinking vehicles. Trash truck to block, tow truck to sack. Get some disguises, and we're gold. We just gotta hope like hell these are the kind of agency men that don't carry a panic button with them. If they are, we deal with it. If and when. If and motherfucking we. I will keep my eyes peeled, General. Thank you, Michael. Hey, no problem. No, really. Alright guys, a few more details. We'll need boiler suits and masks for this job. Garbage truck. Let's get one from your park. Bring it back through the lot. And there's an auto repair place by the airport where we can get a tow truck. What else? Uh, oh yeah, 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 get away. That would be nice. Get something fast and discreet. We park it off the road a good distance from the lot. And make sure it ain't near something we'll crash into driving off. That's it. Alright man, I got you, dawg. What? Huh? I missed that. Maybe shout a little louder? Bite me. You're my fucking fool. Oh, Did you just spin me out, you little dickhead? Okay. Buy the boiler suits. Makes you proud to be an American, doesn't it? Like a candy store for adults, isn't it? Offered me a job in corporate? I said no. This is where I go. Okay. Come off the 
shopping list. end up in the back of this. Sake. Over there. They trapped me in, bro. They're using different tactics all the time. Not the best place to put a uh, garbage truck, but there you go. Fucking bell and don't get stuck. <sighs> Only going stuck, haven't I? Fucking bell and garbage truck, man. What am I meant to do? What am I meant to do? <sighs> Puss was out in the wilderness. Nice job.
We evade the police and then get stuck on a fucking tree. Mate, the, the tree is on arch nemesis in this. You know, it really is the fucking arch nemesis. You know, is it a bird? Is it a plane? That's no, just another fucking tree that I'm stuck on. I'll take your bike, thank you, pal. Right. Let's take this fucking garbage truck again. Away, dickhead. Right. Taking this garbage truck. Give me that truck. Run! You don't want to end up in the back of this. Don't go this way, you fucking moron. Oh, I'm so sorry. Fucking please take the piss, man, sometimes. Right, do I stop? Right, there you go. Fuck off, man. Please piss off. <laughs> Please, fuck off. <laughs> right. And after literally. That was skills. Alright. <sighs> Survey the police.
fucking nightmare of a mission that one because the fucking um, bin lorry is really slow. The bin lorry is so slow and then they trap you in like a crossroads. So you are, I was literally going to just throw a sticky bomb and hope it hits them, not me. And then obviously I found a way out, luckily. Right. I'm happy about that. That we managed to uh, finally do that in the second take. Did look like one of those missions that was just going to be a mission that we'd have to do over and over and over and over again. Okay, trash truck taken care of. Is there anything up here? Nope. Okay. Got two things here. Let's go for this one next. Sanitation truck's there now, so don't you bother. About this is a getaway vehicle. Where you from, huh? Look at this. Uh, this can be vehicle can be used vehicle hide it in discrete location, select the getaway vehicle. Angle. Let me just move my camera, guys, for a second. Okay. So what it's saying is, if we put this in a discrete location, we phone Michael and mark it as a getaway vehicle. Fucking bike, man. Hey, old bro. Fuck, you got it. Thanks, man. Seriously, you saved my ass. 
You're the man, buddy. What can I say? I've never liked bullies. Draw a point. It's not wrong there. Vehicle ready and waiting. Good work, T. Where'd you put it? La Mesa. We're going to go to that location next. Steal the tow truck, okay. Oh shit! <laughs> so much smoke! Hey! That's my tow truck! <laughs> You're gonna wish you stayed in bed, boy! <laughs> Unlucky chump.
Okay, that's one more item done. We'll come back to that in a sec. Okay. Oh, look, I don't want any problemas, okay? Keflam, Keflam. Hello! Back, hey, man! So I guess the only way we're really going to gain money if we rob a store. I, I knew your fucking alien. Yes, shit about the army was traveling. Yep. I had no money, bro. Not exactly gonna just be able to grab money.
I need a man so bad. Pero qué gilipollas. What the fuck are you doing in Davis? I thought you might have gone home with that little yep. number. Oh, hi. Yeah, this is going to be a bit of a nightmare. Ah, <sighs> this is annoying, man. We do this mission for now. Just trying to hang on until tomorrow. Shit. Oh shit. I'm going to enjoy kicking. And then we should have some money when it comes to doing that other quest. Shits must be here. Hello, Trevor. I missed you. Hello, Wade. I missed you too. Uh, hello, Trevor. Oh, there. Hey, Hot Lips. Where you been hiding? No, no, no nowhere. I got a, a knot the size of a baseball in here. All right, needs a little uh, loosening up. All right. Oh, <laughs> massage me, motherfucker. Good, good. Trevor's hard at work, huh? Uh, where's the surrogate child? Who? Uh, the boy! With the stars in his eyes. Not like that. What's not like that? Oh, hey! Hey there, uh, You and him, the old father-son issues? Gives me the fucking creeps. How's the leg rub? Oh, it's excellent! Fuck, you wanna go? No, I'm good, though. Hey, I, I called you boys here to discuss this job that I've been planning. What the fuck are you talking about? Shut the fuck up, Michael, all right? You owe me. Hey, did you talk to Lester? I called him. He's in the hospital or something, all right? We keep him out, and we get 20%. Well, unless, of course, you go states again and uh, have me arrested. Hey, it wasn't like that. You better not have been. I mean, like, you give a fuck. Oh, see, I give a fuck, Michael. It's a position, a fucking viewpoint, all right? Like God, like evolution, like anything else. Sunshine, boredom, lies. That's what we got. Other people, they have other worlds. But for me, I'm like a vulture just circling the desert looking for fucking corpses. You know, a carrion eating motherfucker. Do you understand that? Wow. Woo! Bravo, you fucking idiot. Man, I still don't get the score. What's the fucking plan? We got Floyd! All right? Now, Floyd's got not to fuck get out of here. All right? Now, Floyd here works at the port. He puts me onto Meriwether Security, who were running some tests out at sea for Uncle Sam. We're gonna take whatever it is they're testing. Now, I've got a couple buyers lined up. I guarantee no problems, no major heat. Mm, let's get going, all right? Let's take our slightly past dead vibe to an airfield where I got a sub, got a chopper, I got everything we need. All right, let's do this, you fucks. Sandy Shores Airfield, if you please. Sandy Shores? That's quite a distance. What's with this guy? Man, I didn't realize he was going all the way out there either. I've been told your generation are work shy. 
Repeatedly. But this is the first time I've seen it for myself. You won't leave the city for the biggest take of your life? Man, it's not like that. Well, what is it like? Huh? Get out the fucking way. You think the world owes you a living? You want money and respect, but you won't cross the street to get it. That useless millennial shit is more of a middle class thing. Where I'm from, hustling is still hustling. And going halfway across the state is still a... Uh, going halfway across the state? Yeah, well, Sandy Shores is the global headquarters for TP Inc., okay? So we gotta make the trip. TP Inc.? Trevor Phillips Industries. My company. Industries or Incorporated? If it's TP Inc., it'd be Trevor Phillips Incorporated. Just saying. You're mocking me! Nice! Is it so strange that I've made a success of my life? I know that wasn't what you wanted for me when you ran off, but still. Trevor! It's a business, Michael. An honest American business, and there aren't many of them left. Hey, you know this airstrip we're going to, we're managing it. Yeah, I hate to think what you did to the last managers. The lost MC LLP experienced an unexpected downturn. We had to step in. The Lost Motorcycle Club. <laughs> yeah, you're a serious businessman, T. I cannot believe this. The hard-working entrepreneur is getting shit from a guy so lazy he retired in his 30s. And then from this other guy whose sense of entitlement is so strong, he asks how far we had to travel when he's offered a job he ain't even qualified to do. This is why the country is screwed. There's not enough me's, there's too many you's. Yeah, a country full of you's. That's just what this world needs. Shit would get done. It would be Darwinian. Hey, look, dude, we helping you out. But if you think you'd be better off on your own... No, 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 hey, look, hey, the God is there. Oh, just let's call we have a score to take. There is profit to be made. I mean, don't that be getting picked up by G-Men and forced to work for free? Yeah, 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 all right. Talk us through exactly what's going on. We're going out to Sandy Shores. I know that part. My guys will meet us there. They'll have the submarine. I'm going to get into said submarine then. Wait, hold on. You had the flying lessons, right? Ah, flying lessons. Right. You know, I was gonna have them, and then... Oh, you total idiot! Hey, what's the next part of the plane? There's an army chopper at the airfield. You're both getting into it. Mike is flying. Gonna take off, pick up the submarine with me in it, and flying out to a point off the coast. You're gonna drop me into the ocean. I'll pilot the sub down and find the device the government's been tested. I'll get it, surface, you'll fly me back to the airfield. What kind of device? What kind doesn't matter. How much will be paid for it does matter. These are government scientists we're robbing. I said at the condo. The tests are being run by Meriwether Security Consulting. Ah, yes, the mercenaries. Fresh from fighting our secret oil wars. Should be very relaxing. If stealing a prototype like this from the government was relaxing, then everyone would be doing it. As it stands, we've got an opportunity to mint some serious coin. Hey! Hey! Here's the sub! Floyd, wait! Wait in the hangar! I guess this is our chopper. Okay. Were you too busy shipping mimosas by the pool to take your flying lessons? There's a rig attached to your chopper. Hover low over the submarine and they'll connect. Connection is good. Okay. I need to be dropped a couple of clicks west of Polito Cove. Trevor, you got your company name sprayed all over this chopper. But, uh... I got it from the military base. And there's all this military hardware in the back. Guns and whatnot. Mm-hmm. This thing gets hot, they'll come in handy. Hey, I thought 
said it wasn't getting hot. You said no major heat. That you guaranteed it. It's... Hold on a second, guys. Let's turn that off. Drive the submersible into the device to pick it up. Let's go, T. We're waiting on you. 
Nearly fucked it up then. Lift me up. Let's yeah, go. all right, chill, chill, your binge, man. Too. <clears throat> What's it been? Not ten years? After this, the government won't care how long it's been. They're gonna put you and everyone you ever knew on their kill list. And you! I thought you would be smarter than this. What'd I do? Stealing a super weapon to sell to the Chinese! Damn, T. This some nuke or some shit? I thought you said you spoke to him. Yeah, I did! Okay? Kind of. I mean, he was all woozy and shit. It doesn't matter, alright? It's done. We've got it. Well, we could put it back. 
You can drop it in the sea by the time they get a salvage operation together. No! Oh, so you want a drone circling your trailer? We'll get you another score, Trevor. You owe me! Wait, get in that chopper! Listen to whatever this fucking moron has to say. Okay! All right, and on that note, I'm out of here. You won't be seeing me back here in a long time. Hey! We need a score! Remember! Man, I thought I was done not getting paid for these licks. Hello! Me too! Trophy and submersive. So we need to have money. <laughs> Definitely need to have money. Got $26 to our name. Yeah, that's not really going to work at the moment, bro. Um, the only thing I can really think is, as usual, if we rob some places. Yo, I'll take your money if you want. Contracts. You burnt a farm, killed my brothers! You had too many brothers! They needed culling! You're fucking dead! Aren't we all? We live and we die, that's our curse. Hey, you want to expedite the situation? Come fucking find me! Vespucci Beach, Los Santos, you inbred hillbilly fuck! I'll be there, man! I don't know when, but I'll be there! It was a shit time to answer a call, pal. Why did you answer it right there? <clears throat> shit time to answer the call, man. Yeah, still $26 to his name.
Don't shoot! Oh, you God! make me want a lobotomy! You bastard! Well, this is a bit stupid, isn't it? How are we going to get money? So it says, in order for us to... Right, let me just try something. This motherfucker clean. Where's this race? Because apparently if we win a race, we will win money. Let's have a look. Couldn't see any races, we're gonna have to rob a store then by the looks of things. Just for the uh, fact that Trevor can get this money. You 
and give my regards to Johnny K. Ah! Man, I can't believe you got that here. guy. You really saved my ass. There you go. I persuaded him to change his mind. Wow, insane. I'd say you earned yourself a reward, bro. Ah, don't thank me. I'd have tried to kill them all anyway. That's my turn to rob a bank. How do you rob money from fucking discount stores, man? What we really need to do, guys, is we need to be able to get Trevor to get some money. So how to get Trevor money in GTA 5? So we need to compete in a race. There's got to be a race around here. Okay, let's go for this. Fuck it. Definitely not going to be able to race in that. Because that would just be dog shit. We've kind of fucked ourselves over by buying a shit ton of stuff that we shouldn't have bought. And I forgot about this buying the masks that business. Uh, we've got $51 still. 
so that's all right. Yeah, don't think you are, pal. Personally. that bike. Oh, come on, for fuck sake, man. We're not having much luck at the moment, guys. We're just having a bit of a shit time. Yes, I could do better in terms of not trying to crash my car. How that fucking... Damaged me the way it did. I don't Damn. know. No! Ah! Ah! Dirt bag! Shit, shit, shit! You picked the wrong guy. game is going out of its way to piss me off, I tell you. This game is going out of its way to piss me off. Nice. Word of advice, guys. Do not spend Trevor's fucking money. Oh, of course, we have this shitty-ass vehicle, don't we? On for the next one. Give me your fucking vehicle and don't make it crash into the water. I 
Are you for real? So because I ran one tiny fucking incident, I'm suddenly getting the uh, cops called on me. Great stuff. Try and finally do this ATV race. Okay, the invisible race apparently. Why the fuck is this not? Why is it not even letting me fucking do that either? The only thing that I can think of is that we sell Sandy Shores hunger. Okay, I know we're in third person at the minute, guys, but we just really are trying to sort this out. Um, it's very frustrating.
it's very frustrating because obviously I completely forgot that you have to buy masks and so I bought some accessories I think I bought his haircut um, I think the hanger was the massive one that I bought without realizing that we need to somehow keep some form of money um, and because he's only got basically $51 to his name he has to buy three of these um, masks would you like to say and they're all £200 each or $200 each but the only thing I can think of doing is selling this hanger fuck was that Is this even the one? I think he might have been this one, you know. Okay, it's not too far away. But we need to sell, really. We need to sell something or rob something in some way or it's just a case of wandering around the city and finding one of those armoured trucks. Now again I didn't realise that at that point when I seen the armoured truck and I didn't decide to rob it was that one time I needed to rob it. this hunger Let's be honest, frankly, is well and truly broke. Can we sell it? <sighs> it's going to be very, very annoying.
Yeah. Just trying to figure something out. Basically, um, uh, Trevor, I bought a bunch of stuff for Trevor, and one of the missions you have to buy a bunch of stuff, so I'm trying to figure out how to get money to buy masks. It's very annoying. That is where it is. Yeah, it's fine. Just sit on that radio all day. I just got a tip off. The Salvadorians found out about a drop we're getting near the docks. You gotta get there. Quick, T, or we're gonna lose the package. Oh, when are these clowns gonna get the message? Oh. oh, guys, what are we doing? Can we replay the mission? Because that was just fucking dreadful. Uh, Mate, come on now. That's not going to knock me over like that, is it? Give a fuck, I'm gonna kill you if you don't fucking get out of the vehicle. Thank fuck for that. Alright guys, we're back in business. Ah, <sighs> man. Right, we can actually do the mission now. Well, I apologise for the wait, guys, but we have finally done this mission. I don't even realise you could gain money from doing that, but there you go. Didn't think it is where it is. Drive this aeroplane takes a lot less time to get there than Oscar. drive. Tango, Foxtrot, Whiskey, Oscar. I didn't know that was a mission, bro. I didn't even know that was a mission. If I entered that. Okay. Right. 
so we have to travel all the way back down here but we can finally do what we need to do Right, sorry for that guys, obviously it was like nearly half an hour to an hour of really just not knowing what I'm doing. Um, I was trying to, basically what I've done is I've added additions onto Trevor, such as like, you know, your haircuts and um, accessories and things like that. And the annoying part about it is... I had done all the other missions and I literally, you know, tried to rob a store, wouldn't, couldn't figure out how I was doing that. You know, I have played this before though, you know, I just really can't remember how to do certain things on here and it's not clear, you know, it doesn't tell you, you know, some things it does and other things it doesn't. So the store hijacking didn't work. We tried to sell Mackenzie Field, that didn't work. You know, and I was slowly thinking, oh shit, I've fucked the game up here. But then we found that mission where, believe it or not, we get in a bung in a one of those little vehicle things. Really not with it in terms of what the vehicle's called. I think it's a buggy. But, um, anyway, each time you get in it, you basically can do side missions to get yourself up. So I'm happy that I've got to what I needed to do now. You know, I've got five grand from that mission alone. Wasn't the most difficult mission either. Got a little bit lucky in terms of shooting the rival driver straight away. But if I knew all this, all that time, you know, half an hour bit prior to this, um, then I would have done it straight away. Um, and you could be saying, well, surely you've done this mission before. I don't actually remember doing the, um, you know, the Mackenzie missions. You know, there's a little bit of different additions. Obviously, like I say, we're playing in first person as well. We were playing in third person for a time. We were shit out of luck with everything that was happening. It's just one of those moments, guys, where, you know, we went to rob a vehicle. We drive backwards and it somehow fucking crashed off the side of the bridge and went into the water couldn't find another vehicle we went to an ATV race and an ATV race didn't happen uh, you know it was just one of those moments where everything was, that could possibly go wrong with the game was going wrong and uh, all because we bought some extra tattoos for Trevor a haircut for Trevor and a different top basically for Trevor now, if I knew, obviously, that you could transfer money between each other, which I'm not, still not sure if you can do that. I don't think you can. But Franklin is basically, you know, he's loaded, he's well off. He's got, like, four vehicles, do you know what I mean? So if we were, to, if we were able to transfer that money from Franklin to Trevor, then it wouldn't be an issue. But that's not, any, that's not even an option. You know, every side hustle mission we did already. Or the majority anyway, I think we might have missed a couple. But, uh, back in business, we can finally buy some $200, $200 masks. For, uh, with our five grand. Okay. Oh, you want a problem with me, do you? I ain't afraid of you. Oh, sorry, dude. Yeah, well, fuck you too. You're gonna get fucked. 
You wanna fight as well, do you? Okay. Now I've gotta escape again. Not on that, because that's a fucking. <laughs> I'm not escaping on the pizza delivery vehicle, guys. Fuck that shit. I agree. Nice car, to be fair. Mate, you literally just took a photo of my vehicle. Right. Let's put this vehicle in our little... ...area. How do we save that vehicle? can buy the masks at last. Let's... Come on, you got her, yo. What's good, Jody? Nah, I had to take the Pagani to the shop. Who am I driving now? What are you driving? Hey, what's up? Whoa, don't need to find peace, bra. Goodbye, friend. Just to say, I got us some headgear for this masquerade balls up. Okay, that's everything. Come back to the lot and I'll talk you through the plan. When we get the stuff, Steve man. says we gotta take it to Devin Weston, the guy we met at that interrogation. It's a big investor or something. Anyway, that don't matter. I'll handle the drop-off. I finally fucking can do this now. Yeah, word of advice, guys. If you ever play this as a walkthrough or you just want to play it as our own game without having to stream it, whatever you do, do not buy anything with Trevor until you've done most of the heists. That's my opinion.
Is it worth it? Yeah, fuck it. Open fire! Okay, we definitely got some money now. Didn't let you go that time, did I, buddy? Nope, I'll check that opportunity. Okay, we've got eight grand now. We are solid. That's after we bought the masks as well. So that's also a massive positive. So we really finna do this shit? We finna risk our lives to rob some motherfucking government killers again? Yep. Hey. hey. Alright. Let's sit up. Here's the plan. Hey, right, Trevor. Yeah. I want you in this position up here. Yeah, you're on lookout. Give me a heads up when the armored car comes by. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna be right here. In the garbage truck blocking the roadway. Franklin, you're in the alley. In a tow truck. Hope is, they pull right up in front of you. When they do, you come at them hard. Bam. Shit, here's hoping. Yeah, after the hit, we blast open the doors, grab up all the cash, bonds, whatever it is, I take it to Haynes' guy. It's all a little hopeful, homie. As long as I am not on the ground when the shit goes down, okay? When the shit goes down, we'll handle it. You stay up here, on your post, eyes peeled. Yeah. Okay. We'll take the risk. Sound cool? Shit, you the professional, dog. And at least we're not wearing clown outfits. There's a plus. Right, the masks. What? Let's see what we got here. Huh? Real professional. <laughs> Let's do this. Let's go, let's go.
right, T. I'm in position. What's the ETA? Where are they? I got a visual on the target. Should be with you any moment. All right, Mike, move it! Get the truck in position. Block both lanes of traffic. Just stop in the road and stay there. Ready, Frank. Did Public Works change their schedule? You better brace yourselves, you motherfuckers! They're going down. They up on that building, man, right there. Take these snipers out all done, dog. I dropped that fucking car. Just hold on. Oh! 
Where? Which building, man? Can't fucking see no building. Just hold on. This one? There he is. There goes the second shooter. All we gotta do is ride this out. There's tons of these assholes. Hold them. T, the cop sniper's on the roof opposite of yours, man. I still have no idea where they're 